So, which evil cabal are we taking on first? Make no mistake. You look like someone who's had just about enough of this, bollocks. Am I right? Oh, shit. You're dead sick, right? You gotta help me. I mean, can't guarantee anything, but we'll try. What's up? So I was in with these Clan Kelly smugglers. Like, it was a proper job. We'd smuggle in bougie shit from the mainland. You know, cheese and wine and whatever. But that shit's gone out of control, man. I've been roped into some big shipment of guns coming in. Go on. I'm getting the fuck out of this life. But first, I have to make things right. I need you to help me take care of the guns that are coming in. Cut off this shipment for good, yeah? Right. Right. I'll set things in motion. Hey, cheers, bruv. Do me a solid, and I'll repay you sometime. I'm not saying that it's you or anything. I don't think you can really make many choices between us. Serious? I suppose you can disagree. Free country, yeah. Look where that's got us. Calm down. The weapons shipment is being prepared at one of Clan Kelly's hideouts. I'll send you the coordinates. I've got this. Albion have established an operational base in the Royal Court of Justice. Albion own the bloody courts now. It's like picking up a go directly to jail card at this point. Exactly. But it likely means there's information here about how Albion are targeting dissenters, the who and the why. We need that data if we're going to disrupt their operation.
Bagley, what have we got? A list of what Albion consider high-value targets that are threats to the peaceful running of London. See here, a journalist, and this one runs a community shelter. Good God, bar your doors. What the fuck? All suspected of sowing rebellion or exhibiting tendencies towards... <laughs> Albion is systematically arresting people even before they rise up. Joke's on them. This list can actually help us find like-minded allies willing... To help us. Well done. Now, let's disrupt some of Albion's propaganda and give some hope to the people. Transferred the funds using cryptocurrency. They said it was crime-free. Well, it's new jobs, isn't it? Gotta have new jobs. They said it was patriotic. They lied. Cryptocurrency. If you can't see it, how can you really trust it? This is the new normal, innit? To see Albion's brand everywhere you look. At least that's what they have us believe in, fucking dickheads. There's going to be that much less once you're done here. Let's give Camden a break from these eyesores. I've got this. Hijack that scissor lift. You could use it to access the rooftop. Yes, nicely done. That'll get people's attention. Let them know someone is standing up to Albion. Light the spark that they can stand up to. If nothing else, it'll relieve their eye strain. What now?
We're already seeing results from what you've done. That list we found named a journalist in Camden who's been investigating Albion. We reached out and he's got information that can help us. I think you should meet with him. Send me the coordinates. Uh, do you need some help? What's up? Your recruit's been sticking it to Albion. Can't believe someone else is. Thought I was alone, right? Not doing much, just putting the word out. But you? Taking action, mate. What else can we do? I'm not gonna sit and watch while this city burns. Albion's gotta go, but they're not leaving without a good ass kicking. What's your intel, then? Almost got clip finding this. All of Albion's operational data for the entire city. Convoy routes, surveillance targets, assets. It's all there. Thinking you can make good use of that. That's a goddamn truth. Here's a sample. Albion's closed King's Cross to the public, right? But what people don't know is that they're using it as their logistics centre. Materials, troops, whatever. A lot of it runs through there. You want to give the people a huge boost? Hit that place. Put it out of commission, and you'll severely hamstring Albion's operations here in Camden. Hell, everywhere. That's the plan, then.